Chuck Bartowski. Oh, I'm going to pause it. Paused and ready to vlog in the vlogging position. Oh, no, no, there you go. Now I'm ready to vlog in the vlogging position. <laughs> so, I just read an article. An article? A re newspaper report? An, uh, I guess a news article. And it was talking about how a supermarket in England called Tesco's um, <laughs> rhymes with Pesco. Uh, basically, uh, uh, basically, there's a woman who found a twelve twelve newborn mice in a value packet uh, of multi-packet crisps. Which is just unbelievable. I, I actually really don't believe it's real. I think that it's a scam. I mean, I could be horribly wrong, and you know, but there's just like <laughs> some of the things that I mean. If you've got mice in a packet of crisps or multi pack or whatever it was, and you're in Tesco's, you will have to pick up the pack of, of crisps. Put it in your trolley, then take it to the checkout, all upon which not seeing it move or anything, um, then giving it either to a person or using one of those self-service ones, okay, and bleeping it through yourself, handling it again, then putting it into your trolley, handling yet again, then taking it out of your trolley and placing it in your car, then taking it home and unpacking it. Now, with all these times of doing that, you think you would have noticed a warm group of 12 mice, newborn baby mice, let alone they may have ma might have made noise. The fact is is that apparently it was just newborn so the mother wasn't with them, which is unlikely. Um, apparently they were crawling, they were crawling out of the packet across her kitchen work space, whatever you want to call it, a counter, kitchen counter, that's it, um, and a work colleague was with her, conveniently. Um, this is like a single mum with a kid, a new kid, and I'm just like, the condom story was a hell of a lot more believable than that one. I mean, even the mayonnaise story, ugh, as nasty as that was, more unbelievable than mice. And apparently they spent in pest control. They sent in pest control. Pest control was there all day. And they didn't find squat. They didn't find anything. Now, you would have at least found pff, a nest. More nests. Pellets. Droppings. Uh, <laughs> stores of food. Basically, my stuff. <laughs> uh, and they didn't find anything. So I'm just like... Yeah. That's not adding up. So Tesco's has apologised. They haven't really done anything else for it. So I'm going to guess that they're thinking it's fishy too. So yes. Merry Christmas. I'm going to scam Tesco's. <laughs> so yes. I'm going to go to bed now. Well actually I'm not going to go to bed now. I do end most of my vlogs with I'm going to go to bed now. I'm actually going to sit which is what I mostly do, sit on my computer, play with stuff such as Facebook and Frontierville, and watch Chuck until about one o'clock in the morning, upon which I will turn everything off and go to sleep. I think that's about it now. You have now been entered into the boogie world of booginess. Good night, YouTubians. Good night. <laughs>